you say judgment, and I just want to make I, I want to make an observation. If I point out what you're doing, that's not judging. I'm pointing out what <laughs> what you're doing. Yeah, I'm always gonna point now, out your behavior, but I'm not gonna you say you're not judgment. safe. Yeah, if I'm looking at you. Yeah, that's the point she's making. Marla. Not all judgments yeah, that's, are bad. Though. Yeah, not all judgments are bad. We're going to judge. This is a whole other thing. I don't want to use the word judgment because people keep saying, if I look at you and do that, you're doing something. Well, don't judge me. Not what you're judging. doing? That, 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 that's <laughs> not the sense that I meant. It. Yeah. I well, meant that I'm not going to sit here and tell somebody, right "Oh, you're not safe." No, that well, I can't do that's, that. That's, that's what but, I'm not going to do. But, but here's the thing, though, and I agree with you, Tracy, and, and I get it, but that puts you guys into a corner that yeah. you can't get out of, right? Mm -hmm. Because that means that people who abuse your faith, you can't fight them because you can't say yes, that can. they're not truly following the faith. How? Um, how? Oh, you wait. use the Bible as your judgment stone. You don't use your and own the Bible opinion. Says, and the Bible says that oh, there's only one judge. But you didn't read the rest of that verse, though. Exactly. See, people just stop it. Yes, that's your not judge. Hold on. No, but no, wait a minute. No, Hold on. No. I'm, 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 I'm trying to. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Exactly how they play the Bible. People will say, "Oh, well, just says don't judge," but you don't read the the, the verses down where it says, <laughs> "When do you judge?" It's already. Mom, Ma Ma one second. I want to hear her say this. Help me I'm out. saying that yes, the Bible says, "Judge not, unless he be judged." clearly states that however mm -hmm. there's more verses if you read the whole chapter that whole chapter there's a context to that that people completely miss and this is what they completely miss they miss the point where and if and i'm not i'm not sharp on this as i would like to be but mm -hmm. jesus says something about to the fact of when you judge don't condemn the whole thing is to Yes, you can point out, hey, Anna, you wrong for taking my pork chop. You just wrong. But I can't send Anna to hell for taking my pork chop. Right. There's a You're difference. To, you don't have the power to determine the final Yes, I use pork chop. I couldn't think of nothing right? else. You, no, it was a perfect <laughs> analogy. Right, I can okay. I can tell you that what you're doing does not line up with the spirit of yeah. what I know. Exactly, I can tell you that Jesus specifically taught against this. I can tell you that when they wanted to stone that woman for adultery, and he stopped them, and he said, mm -hmm. "Let the first without sin cast a first stone." Right, so right. all these things, I you put all these things out. The spirit of the Bible is very clear, but we like to get into the text, which has been doctored and altered over the years yeah. and use those as cudgels however we choose to do so but the mm -hmm. point i was getting about where it puts you in a corner is that it's hard to fight with one arm kind of behind your back because they know everything you know and they'll just sit there and talk louder mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and that's it's what so you, unfair that, it's an unfair battle all i can say to that is i know you, yeah, I don't know. I don't argue with nobody on Bible, period. I won't do it. I'm not going to get into arguing with you. I'm not going to just, well, I'll discuss That's anything. part of my point. But that's part of my point. When the good, mm -hmm. when the good know that they're good, but because they're good, they do not oppose evil. Evil is able to go and corrupt more. You see but what I'm saying? Who's not opposing so evil? You're, if you're saying that I'm not going to argue with you, I'm not going to push no, back against you, I ain't going through none of that. Because either you that, believe or that, you either believe or you don't. That, that's the way I see it. So, now I could be so totally fine. wrong. And that's, I'm, not, I'm not trying to move you off your position. What I'm saying is if that is the position that a person takes, let's say I take that position because I kind of hold that. You're saying you know, there's not, a like, better way, like way to that. fight. Well, right? there's but always a better way to fight. But if you're was I not okay? So a better Jesus? way to put this, I guess, is if a if not direct opposition, what does the opposition look like? Yeah, you I just think, lost me. I right think that's there. more fair. So, like, if if someone you got that guy in Tennessee with the tent, you know that guy. Oh yeah, the fake you know, We all know who the yeah. guy is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, he's he's got a real congregation. He, he has a real pastor. congregation. <laughs> so, you know, they all got guns and, and, and doing some weird stuff. But hey, you know, um, but like you said, if that person is speaking in your midst, if your response 
is, and I'm not saying that everybody should do it and start trying to shout everybody down because that's that just creates noise. But mm-hmm. if the response is, oh, well, this person is so far off and way out there, you I'm not even gonna say nothing about that. I'm just gonna go my own way and, and go go over here. Fair enough. I actually hold to that a lot of times. But the thing would be, but what's going to be the other action? Like, how can well, you there, oppose? Okay, so but there's a way to approach that, and that also is in the Bible. When you find someone who is doing something offensive, you approach that person, like, one-on-one. If they don't listen, then you bring another person, and you approach that person. If they still don't listen, you bring yourself, another person, another person. You approach that person. If they still don't listen, you take that person before the congregation. And if they still don't listen, see you later. But now that would assume, and I'm with you, you, and I'm not nitpicking. I'm not nitpicking because I get the, the point of what you're saying. Wow. Right? You come to a person in confidence and you say, hey, I heard what you were saying. It doesn't line up with what my understanding is. And I question if it really fits what you understand. Can you help me understand where you're coming from? Right? right. You come in confidence to that person. And then that yeah. person blows you off. And then you go get someone else who may be either more learned in it or more respected or right. whatever. And you bring that person in. And then you, you, you that only works, though, in the event that you're dealing with a fellow believer, truly a fellow believer, because you keep bringing people all you want to. The moment you say, well, look, we are at an impasse. And what you're doing is really discouraging the word getting to the right people. You, you, are, you are actually bearing witness in a way that causes more harm to the kingdom than benefit. And you won't listen to me. You won't listen to our elders. You won't listen to the pastor. We're going to have to take this in front of the congregation. At that point, let's say I'm the offender. I'm like, I don't recognize your authority. <laughs> then you no, have to I'm be dismissed. Yelling. I mean, that, that's <laughs> very clear. You have to. I mean, but you is, can dis- I, I have to put so it should, back on my thing, though. That, we should that, only that be in our... Right, I'm talking that's about me. believers. I'm not talking about, like, outside people. No, I'm I mean, clearly even, but even someone who's I mean, using the faith even may even not be a believer, but they're pretending to be. Yeah, even if you're a believer, though. It, that's still, I, I still have is, I still have to put that as, yeah, you may be the outlier of the group. The people who may be like, you know what, maybe, you know, I'm in the wrong. Maybe I do need to listen to them more. I believe there's more people like that who will. Yeah, you always going to get that one on. knucklehead that says, yeah, you oh, I'm right. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. that. That's yeah. that. Mm-hmm. that Donald Trump. I'm always right. Only I alone can fix it. Blah, 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 person. You always going to have that person. Now, Tracy, let me let me push back on you mm-hmm. on one thing, and then I'm going to get to the comments. I, I understand exactly what you were saying about eating the pork chop, and I can judge I like you. Pork chop. I can yeah, please took your pork chop because I don't like pork chops. Well, what? Okay. Chicken. Okay. Anna took my chicken. Okay. Okay. I get the story. I would take your and everything chicken. Else. I can't tell you that you go to hell because you she... took the last bit of piece of chicken. Well, I don't like drumsticks. So... But I can tell. But I can tell you one thing real quick though. <laughs> I can't tell you you go to hell for eating chicken. You go to hell for eating all the toppers off the top of a damn pizza. I'm sorry. You got <laughs> That to. is not what he's you going back to do. He I did not come you back. Going to heaven on that, man. I can't, I can't see that. No, that no. That I don't think that route. I can't see you that. You know, I mean. At the Last Supper, path. I don't think that came up. I can't see you... that path. Oh, we don't know what was said at the Last Supper. Huh? Oh. huh? We don't know what was said at the Last Supper. We don't, but I don't think that Judas was over there eating all the pepperoni <laughs> off the pizza like he was normal. Judas became Judas for a reason. That made me look. Why does this do Boy, like yeah, really. Why is Judas taking all the skin off the damn, um, slip, yeah. off the grapes? <laughs> what the hell is going on here? Let me go ahead and read these comments. <laughs> Please slip. do. But Paul, but Paul would have been the one double dipping in the marinara sauce. I already know. It's yeah, not he's not like something he would do. Mm. Florida would be like, Parker, Florida would be like, okay, kids, your job is to mark out all the references to Japanese and, and 
internment camp or some other bad historical thing. The know, Holocaust, uh, slavery. The Holocaust, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, yeah. I don't, I doubt that. Mickey, one Christ of Fascist. Christ of Fascist. Christ of Fascist parent can object and the book is bad. Even if the other 200 parents didn't want it bad. And, and Mickey, yep, I'm not taking words to your mouth. They're talking about that one the- lady who put in the most laziest um, the poet. What, what this was talking about. If you actually pull up the paperwork on what it was, what did the guy say? It was a total of 30 words on a piece of paper that got that book banned. Because oh, wait a minute. I missed something. people with ill intent will put forth the effort to achieve the goals that they have. Most people don't want to be involved, don't have a problem, or just make and do and they're living their lives. They're not going to get involved. Therefore, that one lady who happens to be tied to the Proud Boys, I think is the one that she's tied to, that lady oh, she got that is pool. the okay. only voice, right? That's like they say, yeah. like you hear from politicians all the time, especially House members, where they hear from the same 50, 60 people every day. So it starts seeming like there's more of them than there actually are. Because the rest of us, mm-hmm. man, we, I ain't never called my... <laughs> really? <laughs> never? You never and have? I'm involved You've and never, never called? Call oh, you need to be calling. What? Because you're a citizen and you're concerned about hey. the environment around you. And um, hey, I'm concerned about black people in America. That's why you need to be calling them, especially <laughs> if they're not black. <laughs> yeah, that's a good <laughs> Parker, we all know the number one book that kids are rushing to read is the in the school mm-hmm. the Bible. LOL. I wonder what percentage of kids even know the Bible is at their library. They probably know it. They just probably just walk right past it. Because they got one at I, home. I knew that's who had the Bible, but I've never checked the Bible out. In yeah, who, che- who, che- who does that? Oh, I'm sorry, Tommy. You're not going to be able to get that today. It was. Uh, it's currently checked out. Right. Never happened. Right. Judas and Tamar? Judah and Tamar. Brother rapes sister. Oh, uh, thank you. Parker, Tracy, it was... Yes, Marilyn Murray O'Hare. Yes, that's who it... Oh, my and, gosh. And, and folks, oh. y'all right now, when we go to... Or, we, or do it when we go to break. Look this woman up and tell me if she wasn't the first Karen. Don't listen to her. No. Oh, no, no she uh, wasn't a Karen. I mean... Her. Just, the first look Karen. At her. Just look at her. I mean, she went... If, if Karen is not the First thing that pops in your head when you see her, I promise you, don't go look at no videos of her talking because she talks a little, <laughs> but don't listen. So, don't listen to her, just look at her picture and go, Yeah, <laughs> that was- I'm sorry, sir, but I'm not going to typecast her based off of her appearance. Mm-hmm. Well, well, yeah, I would- the Supreme Court, Supreme Court 1962, 1962. Okay. and yep. Thank you, man. Yep, Matthew, Matthew Seven. Okay. Yep. Um, he knows the Bible. Parker, I'm not going to pretend like I already knew that fact. I just Googled it. <laughs> <laughs> whatever. Hey, hey whatever <laughs> works. If it works, go for it. Look, okay. look I'm, I'm happy for this group because I just see some groups where they got a lot more viewers than I do. And somebody go, and what's that person's name? And what's this person's name? And it'd be like an hour later, they still ain't looked up who that person is. So like, oh, we just gonna pretend like we never talked about that person. We just go, okay, let's just go on. I was like, uh-huh. so nobody's gonna look, okay. Matthew yep, said, sir. Jesus said that for whatever measure you judge, you should be judged yourself. Translation, mind your business, mind your business, else God will read yours out loud. Loud. That ain't, ain't that the truth. Oh boy, that's the. And, and I want to go. Then we start we sliding into in my problem. Never mind. And, and that's and here's the deal, um, everyone. You notice that they always say what God want, what God want, what God want, what God want, what God want. It's very few and far in between. I have yet to come across it, so I'm saying few and far in between because just in case somebody does say it, I've never seen it. I've never seen anybody say what Jesus. I've always seen what God. 
God we said talked about God that said last it. week. Nobody said Jesus said it because it's real easy to go. <laughs> let me flip this book open for you real quick. But when it comes to God in the Old Testament, because the majority of all the judgment that they do, and they're judging, not us, because we found out not to judge. But the, all the judgment comes from the Old Testament. Which is hilarious ah, because the Old Testament I have wasn't even about right. Okay, like, I'm gonna I'm I'm take offense on that one because that's not quite. No, that's not quite. No, I'll, I'll be. Quiet. I have never seen anybody when people say fight Jesus stuff to me. Said, I've never seen anybody say people, Jesus said yeah. this and this is why you should do. I have that's never. That's purposeful when, though. We talked about that last week. Literally last week, we talked about how politicians will say God and God and God, but yeah. they'll never say Jesus. Wonder why. Yeah. It's, it's convenience. It's a convenience. Yeah, it's all it's all about how you control the masses. What's going to stir people up more? Right? If you say God, no one can question that. You say Jesus, now I'm trying to figure out, wait a minute, where'd you get that? Where did you get that from? Right. Yeah, huh? What? Right? What you talking about feeding people? <laughs> like, what you talking about clothing naked not, people? Visit no, people that wasn't in the red text. Have to, have wow, I was about to say that because I said <laughs> that's not in the red text. I didn't read that in the red text, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't understand but, anything anybody said there. Everybody so was in, the, okay. in the King so, James, in the King James version of the Bible, at least the ones that I'm familiar with, there may be some that don't do this. But every time Jesus is speaking, it's done it's in, in red. red. Yep, red. So, yeah. So, so you. It'd be black font and then red, and you'd be like, "Oh, well, this yeah. is what Jesus said. Yeah. It's right to the red." It's kind of like looking at a comic book strip where you know you have the bubble over some uh, certain person's the head main character is speaking flatly by saying, Okay, yeah, pay attention. Said. It's and it's saying, Pay attention to this, we're gonna put it in a different color so you yeah, can look the, at the it. Different uh -huh. color is but because we put it in a different color, we I know you will now true. miss all context to what's going on. No, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I've I've there's a, a Bible in every hotel room. And in every hospital. No, in hotel rooms, it's not the red letter edition. Hotels, they yeah. do, it's just all black. Okay. They, don't, they don't take that extra step. Oh, okay. Yeah, and that was put You got to have a special Bible? I've never what, seen what, what, a what Bible app will do. It's not a There's a denomination that, that does the Bibles in the hotels, though. Gideon's? Like, it's the just Gideon. part of their mission. Gideon, there you go. But they all make right. sure that they, that gets there. Yeah, but it's not in red. It's not the red letter edition. I ain't never read the Bible in my hotel uh, ever. Not, not there. I've read mine. But I ain't never read there. You called out hypocrisy. All the time. All right, everybody. That is our first hour. I have to cut it short because we got a long second hour because we don't have a show tomorrow. And just in case I didn't tell anybody, oh. there is no show tomorrow. We're going to take uh, Sunday off to really reboot. So the second hour is going to go pretty low. So it's a boxy night. So it's a night. No, well, we'll excuse it. Yeah, yeah you can't boo Thank, a you, boxy thank night. you very much. Thank you for protecting my. Now, mind. is this a gift that she wants or is this a gift that you're giving? Because, you know, sometimes you're like, I'm going to spend time with my box. And she like, man. This is the gift that I want. This is the gift that I want to give. Oh, okay. Oh, you're hey gonna guys. cook and clean for uh, it. That's so nice. Of you. All right, that's nice. I love that, man. Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. That's clean the whole house, fold the clothes. So ain't nobody doing all that. So we're gonna go ahead and go into the second hour. So we're gonna take a three-minute break if everybody's new here. Hey, do me a favor, go ahead and hit that like button. We are already up to 10 likes. I don't even know where it came from, but keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. We are up to 10 likes. Go ahead and hit that like button if you haven't already. It's just that little button down at